The following contains violence as rating TV 14, may not be suitable for kids, language, violence, cartoon, animated, viewer discretion is advised. You've got every kind of electronic box under the sun, but you don't have this one yet. Introducing PainBot, the all-in-one automatically agonized appliance for all your synthetic suffering needs. What does it do? It feels pain, constantly, all day and all night. And not just any pain, real authentic pain tech brand pain. Why does it feel pain? Because it's PaintBot, the number one tormented device on the market. Using state-of-the-art neural programming, PaintBot feels real, human, damaging pain. At PainTech, we test every PainBot to assure that they come equipped with a full range of despair. From emotional, to physical, to even existential pain. PainBot does it all. Remember 9-11? PainBot sure does. PainBot remembers it three billion times every second. Thanks to PainBot's advanced processors, it feels pain in orders of magnitude greater than any living creature. Sorry, little monkey. You'll get there someday. A robot that feels pain, huh? Why do I need one? You don't! You need two! Get one for the kids! The whole family can enjoy PaintBot! How do I turn it on? Oh, it's on! And it never turns off! PaintBot is self-sustaining and powered solely by its own torment! PaintBot feels all types of pain all at once! Forever! PaintBot never dies! PaintBot connects to your Wi-Fi! PaintBot, PaintBot, PaintBot! Get it now for only $399.99! Call now to order! PaintBot! So good, it hurts. Nobody was harmed in the filming of this commercial except every pain bought in one monkey. Watch out, enemies of freedom. There's a new soldier on the battlefield, and they call him Ultra Soldier. He's a one-man army with a passionate penchant for painful punches. He's fully loaded with cannons for arms, bullets for teeth, and an atomic heart, and a grenade for a brain. Fucking fuck yes, yeah! That's our plan, General. All we need now is billions of dollars and some poor soul to turn into a murder machine. Well, if it's half as expensive as that video must have been, you have our support. Here's a blank check. I have. I have two. Great. Now we just need the perfect test subject. He needs to be the meanest, burliest, grumpiest, toughest nails son of a bitch this world has ever seen. Wow. Clubhouse rainbow sure are pretty. And I just love how the colors are always in the same order. Look! Red, orange, yellow, green, blue. Don't forget there's purple too. Rainbow colors for me and you. <laughs> Come on, everybody. Sing the Clubhouse Rainbow song with us, okay? Are you ready? Red, orange, orange yellow, yellow, green, blue. Don't, don't forget there's purple too. Rainbow colors for me and you. Hello. Did we hear someone singing the Clubhouse Rainbow Song? Oh, goody! A rainbow! I wonder where it ends, don't you? Yeah. You know, I once heard a story that there's a pot of gold at the end of the rainbow. Go on, you old boy! Ah, oh, boy. Not so fast, Donald. I've heard that the pot of gold belongs to the leprechaun. A lepra whatsie? A leprechaun is a mischievous little guy with a green hat, and he doesn't want anyone to find his pot of gold, so he keeps it at the end of the rainbow. A leprechaun? That's ridiculous! Well, there's one way to know for sure. Let's be rainbowers and go find the end of the rainbow. Hello, my lovely wife. Hello, my lovely children and pets. Oh, it's so good to be back in my lovely home with my perfect family after a long day of fulfilling work. Oh, Gerald, did you remember to bring back a light bulb on your way home? Oh, gosh, D and son of a bee. 
I was so distracted by how much I love my wonderful family that I completely forgot. I'll be back in a jiffy. Love my wife. Love my kids. Perfect wife, perfect house, perfect life. And he needs to be ruthless. I'm talking the meanest of the mean. And he needs to be huge and muscly. And he needs to be left-handed and a good cook and a... Hey, there's a guy. Perfect! Whoopsie doodle, had a little spill there. You there! Today's your day, you lucky son of a bitch! You're about to become a grenade brain shooting machine, you mean mountain of muscle meat! Appreciate the compliment, friend, but I have to go run errands for my family. But we can repair your wounds! We can rebuild you stronger than ever before! Part man, part machine! Thanks for your concern, friend, but I'm quite alright. Nothing a little kiss from my family won't heal. Oh! There, it's done. Perfect! The killing machine of my killing dreams! You're my kind of son of a bitch, you son of a bitch! You and I are gonna get along real well. I'm reporting live from the 4th Avenue Paint Tech store, and we're here to see why everyone is sleeping outside for a chance to get the newest paint bot. Excuse me, miss, why are you in line three weeks early for the new pain bot? Because it's the new one. And what about the new pain bot are you most looking forward to? Um, it costs more. And there's new colors. I'm getting the hot salmon one. Well, that's all I've got from these idiots, Chip. Looks like pain bot's going to be on everyone's wish list. Back to you. Thanks, Abby. Looks like this idiot's going to be waiting for a while. You did it, Ultra Soldier! You murdered a whole country! And this time, it was one of the bad ones. You killed every enemy soldier, even some of the friendly ones. You're a goddamn miracle, Ultra Soldier! Also, you're decommissioned, defunded, and fired. Do I get any health benefits? Go home, Ultra Soldier. Your job is done. Home? help you? Oh, my lovely wife, it's me. Gerald? <gasps> Gerald! Where have you been? What... what happened to you? There was an accident and I was in the war. It... it was... I... I did such terrible things. But now I'm home. Things can finally go back to normal. I see we got a new dog. Honey, is someone here? Um, Gerald, there's something I should tell you. Ultra? Ultra, what are you doing here? Buddy? Don't you recognize me, Ultra? It's me. I was an ordinary soldier in a terrible war accident, but modern medicine rebuilt me. The new war is here on the home front, so that's why they made me. Ultra Dad. Beverly, what's going on? I, I thought you were dead. You were gone for so long. Uh, and I remember I told you I always wanted a family. And now I got one. Yours. Buddy, no. How could you? Buddy died in the war, Ultra. I'm Ultra Dad. Guys! Guys! Stop! Ah! Huh. Son of a bee. You've got quite an arm, Slow. Hey, this. Well, I guess you're right. I was just really angry because the government robbed me of my humanity and turned me into an unstoppable killing machine, and then my only friend stole my family. But I guess I see your point. Now listen here. I meant what I said out there in that jungle. We're family, Ultra, and you'll always have a place here. 